Hey, what's up, you guys? I just want to do a chime in on this subject of Nugs leaving the, the gig tuber niche. A couple of my favorite fellow gig tubers did videos on it, so thanks to uh, uh, Welty and Dasher Binge for giving me a, a content idea while I'm out here on my my vacation time off. So I need to uh, put a video out every once in a while just to keep my channel active. But uh, Nugs has said he's he's leaving before I'm, I'm i think i believe him this time he's he's threatened to you know to, to stop doing gig content or doordash content or whatever you call it but uh he's probably gonna stick with it this time because he, he you know he might look really like a huge liar if he if he can, goes right back to it again but megan did it she's she's doing she hasn't done delivery content in a long time and her, you know her her views have suffered but if you don't care then why not if you're if you're not into it and you think it's stupid you might as well quit doing it and nugs was never a original gig tuber i i started my channel about giving rides that's why it's called uber lift phoenix and i haven't given rides in years but i, I just never bothered to change the name of the channel but Nugs doesn't, he just stumbled into it, and I think Megan did too, and they're tired of it. I just show my, you know, real life experiences surviving off, full time off of gig work. So it's easy for me to just throw an unedited video out there and give an update on, you know, the huge week and, you know, the 100 hours. and But uh, these other channels that that just stumbled into it and decided to do some videos about their trying, you know, delivery work and DoorDash and Uber Eats and all the other stuff. They uh, kind of got stuck into it for a while, but they're, they're tired of it. So I I think that if you're a gig tuber and you want to stay a gig tuber, this, that's a positive thing. If a, if a huge 60,000 subscriber channel's quitting the niche, then that should be a positive thing for us because... People are going to come across this that are doing doing DoorDash and Uber Eats, and I'm doing Spark right now. I'm at the Walmart right now. When I first started giving rides, I, I researched it on YouTube and, and learned a lot of stuff about it. You know, I knew I needed barf bags, and I, I you know it was just you get a lot of information researching something that you're going to try or, or you're doing or you're already doing. And people that do it full time, I think, are the biggest fans of of watching gig tube content so anyway I, I mean i i hope nugs stays successful i'm gonna stay subscribed to him i'll keep watching his videos and i think it was a good decision not to to buy the tesla because if you make fifty thousand bucks in a year to buy a tesla it's still not a good financial decision because it costed you, you know, thousands of dollars to make that money. So, and then why would you want a Tesla if you're doing delivery work? You want a cheaper car that gets good gas mileage or at least a cheaper electric if you want to go electric. But why would you get a Tesla's kind of a luxury car? Why would you need that car if you're doing delivery? If you're so, you know, that's part of your income. So, anyway. I just wanted to chime in on the subject, and I'm not going to stop doing gig tuber content. And if I quit doing gig work, I'll probably just shut my channel down and quit doing videos because my life isn't that interesting otherwise. So, anyway, good luck to Nugs, and I, I wish him the best, and thanks for leaving, you know, leaving more. More views for us guys that are going to continue to do the gig tuber niche. All right, that's it for now. Talk soon. Later.